You know, back in the day before the mega supermarket, folks here used to pick up their staples at the corner grocery, the one with the wooden screen door. And they bought all their produce from the produce man. First in a horse and buggy and later in a truck. And if you think those days though are gone, you have yet to meet Mr. Okra. Now, my daddy started out with a wheelbarrow. Your daddy started yeah. this? Yeah. He, that's what he used to do. Then he went from a wheelbarrow to a truck. Then he went to the house and bugger. And you come along and follow in his footsteps. Right. <laughs> they used to call him Mr. Okra Man. But you see, he used to peddle in the garden district. You see, he didn't come out the garden district. I go all over the city. All over? I go to Lower Ninth Ward. I do all over that, but I haven't been there since, it, you know, the disaster. But I do the whole city. But I don't go uptown. I do all the Frank Quarter, the Bar Water, and out there by City Park. I do all out there. this, don't you? Yeah, I get my kick out of it. You get your kicks out of this? Yeah. <laughs> I meet a lot of people. Yeah? I meet, I meet a lot of nice people. And then I met Dr. Bob, that's who decorate my truck. Arthur, I take it you got hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of customers, but you must have thousands of friends. Yeah. I have a lot of friends. Since I've been into this and coming in the French Quarter, I have a lot of, you know, new friends down here. You think you're ever going to get tired of doing this? Nah, I, I don't do nothing else. When I get through, I go home, take my bath, and look at TV. Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. Didn't I tell you he was a legend? And you know what else he is? He's naturally Nolans. I'm Frank Davis for Channel 4 Eyewitness News.